Okay. Look out, mister. Where's my zombie? How did my zombie horse get up on a cliff? Zombie horse, you are the worst. Zombie horse, where are you going? Hey, this is where the end of Red Dead Redemption proper takes place, somewhere around here. Come on. Come on, come on. Sure do love driving across the great plain of Mexico. Border of Mexico. Las Hermanas. Be back for you. Please stop screaming. Be back. I promise. Whew, I gotta wait to go. Oh, zombie horse. Come on. I'm getting there. I bet I need to go to that town that's on fire. Yep. Wait, it's safe? Chill out, zombie horse. Why is this safe? I didn't do anything. What? All the other towns were on fire, too.
think I like shooting women? You oh, or hey. Rich. That's why this town is safe. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. Go on. Go on, get it. Hello, Mr. Ricketts. Hello, John. I see you're enjoying another vacation in our That's amazing. resort. Something like that. Well, we got sunshine, sand, and a plague that makes people eat each other. Oh, Come all the place I wanted. It must feel just like America to you. What is going on? Uh, I thought things were calmer in Mexico. This is calm. What's a little like cannibalism among friends? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> so, how have you been? Good. Well, apart from my wife and son being tied up and trying to rip my soul clean out of my body, <laughs> and the entire earth turning into hell. Good. Real good. You know, John, I've lived a long life. I've seen this land when it was just wilderness and scrub. I've seen missionaries nailed to crosses by shaman and burn into just the cinders of their misguided devotion. I've seen slaves get set free and return to a bondage even more confusing than the one they left behind. I've seen diseases wipe out entire communities in a weekend. I've seen bad men make their own Valhalla out in the bush, with harems of maidens and the hunting of men as a sport. Most dangerous I've game. I've seen men struggle with principles and morals and the very meaning of existence. You going, s I've killed all going somewhere with this, Ricketts? Killed. Born days seen anything quite like this. Nor me, sir. Now, if uh, we could only get something that uh, would attract these blighters, we could kill them faster and and maybe return this land to its uh, natural state. Some kind of bait? Exactly. I think I might know how. And more dynamite. I'm running pretty low. Let me see what I can do. Thank you, John. Take care. Uh oh. <laughs> ah, Ricketts. Never change. How much? What is the name of this mission? Two six dynamite and two undead baits. I've got both. Awesome. So I can just stay here. Stand with for. I just hope I'm seeing things. This is not the room. This is the room. This is the room. Mr. Ricketts. Hello, sir. How have you been? As you imagine. Good. Did you get the dynamite? Yes. Mm. And the bait. I like that it glows green. Because why not?
traps. Here. Let's work with that for a second. Uh, this uh, calls for a soft touch. Not the brutish hands of a man of war, but the delicate touch of an artist. Some uh, use oils, and some a chisel and a block of marble. For me, sir, it uh, was always either high explosives or the trigger of a fine iron. But it's much the same. Sometimes your humility overwhelms me, Ricky. <laughs> <laughs> you and me both, Mr. Marston. Now, if you'd have seen me when I was a young man, if you'd have seen me when I was so fast, you couldn't see me. Well, then you'd know this is humility. The truth is, well, the truth is long dead. Now we got only memories. Memories and a great swath of demonic mutants, of course. <laughs> Have you heard anything? I heard a man in Chicago was writing a biography of me. And can you believe it? An artist in Pittsburgh painted my portrait. I mean, the demonic hordes. <laughs> Not your own unending glory. No. <laughs> I love rickets. Nothing too interesting. Someone said that there's some really big problems near Escalera. Characters who I like in this game. Ricketts, McDougal, this, Irish, and West Dickens. This up here. That's about it. Take care of yourself. I will. I don't think getting savaged by some brainless corpse would do too much justice to your myth. <laughs> yeah, I think you're teasing me, Mr. Marston. But I thank you. And I appreciate your concern nonetheless. Sometimes I think I've been drunk. Oh, you crazy old man. Anyway, let's head back to uh, Las Hermanas. Las Hermanas. Come here, horse. Come on. Well, R.I.P. Blackwater. I'm not going back there. Is good for nothing anyway. For a frontierman like myself. That that's my southern accent. You'd think I would have a better one living in the south, but I don't. Cougar. That's a weird noise. Finally, the fifth freaking story mission here. Almost. Almost the fifth freaking story mission here. Come on. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna look at this for one real quick second. Pull this back up. Alright, oh, this has been a civilized man. This doesn't need side missions. Oh, that's next one, and then that one. 